My name is Ndidio Konkwongu Nelly. I'm a founder of Leap Africa, the co-founder of Ace Foods, and a partner with Sahel Capital. I'd say the three most significant challenges are human resources as the number one, finding qualified, competent, and passionate people to drive the business, to support the vision, and to take it to the next level. The second has been supply chain. In the agribusiness sector, it's extremely fragmented, so we've had to really go down to the farmer level to group farmers into clusters, to train them, to provide microfinance, and enable them to deliver. And then the third is really building local support for um, proudly Nigerian initiatives uh, from the public sector, from the private sector, and from other civil society organizations. Well, I think the first one is just really being committed and tenacious um, and realizing that with every entrepreneurial venture, you have to take it one step at a time. With the human resource challenge, we have just been very, very um, committed to spending time recruiting the right people, training them and keeping and retaining them, building a culture that attracts mission driven high achievers who are willing to grow with the organization. We gave up the idea of finding ready-made talent. We decided we had to invest in bringing in people who are more recent graduates and training them through the ranks as opposed to bring, finding a, a ready-made talent. Um, and then the second piece, the supply chain, we've partnered with a lot of nonprofit organizations that have skills and expertise in building supply chain organizations. We've partnered with IFDC um, in Kaduna. Uh, they've put the farmers in clusters. So partnerships have been very key to dealing with the supply chain issue. And the third piece, changing mindsets. I think when you show Nigerians early successes, they get excited. They might be skeptical at first. So I think being able to share and communicate what you're doing and uh, appeal um, to a uh, patriotic spirit, and then having a track record of credibility addresses the third challenge. I'll say the first thing is having a very clear vision. Um, it's very easy to copy other people's vision because you think they're doing well and they're making money. But I believe every human being was born with a purpose. In Nigeria, there's so many gaps so many problems and wherever there are problems and gaps there are opportunities so I, I, I always challenge entrepreneurs especially young entrepreneurs to figure out why they were born their purpose figure out what problem they want to solve and commit to solving that problem through an entrepreneurial venture so vision is critical and nothing can displace vision in the life of an entrepreneur the second most important advice I give entrepreneurs in the importance of integrity Integrity, integrity, integrity. Integrity means being authentic, being honest, having um, some level of accountability. Um, I think that goes a long way. In the beginning, it's hard because you're facing challenges, but if you build a reputation of someone who has integrity and your business has integrity, in the long term, you'll succeed. So have that value from the very beginning. I've interacted with LBS students for many years, I would say maybe 20 years, since the early days of LBS, and I've been really impressed with uh, Lagos Business School. Lagos Business fill, School fills a gap in Nigeria. Um, there's a tremendous need for management and entrepreneurial talent, and I think Lagos Business School has played a phenomenal role in enabling this country to build a cadre of management talent we need in businesses and entrepreneurial talent as well. I'm a big, big fan of Lagos Business School, the pioneers, the founders, the visionaries behind it, as well as the very committed faculty and staff.